Are you a dinosaur yet? Subscribe to become one now. Hello all dinosaurs, I'm Dan and today we have a box of Jurassic World dinosaurs and generic dinosaurs. Make sure you subscribe to this channel if you like dinosaurs and Jurassic World, okay? So let's open this up. First one right here, we have a Tyrannosaurus Rex. Let's open this up. Oops, where is it? <laughs> okay, okay, I think it should be right below. Okay, so let's take a look at our first figure of the day. We have a T-Rex. So this is T-Rex from the Jurassic World series. Okay, nice. Very nice figure. You can actually open and close the jaw. So that's our first figure of the day. Okay, let's move on to the latest Allosaurus right over here. Okay, let's take a look at the Allosaurus. Beautiful box right over here. So let's open this up. Let's take a look at the Allosaurus. Wow, looking great. So this is the latest Allosaurus. Not available or worldwide yet, but looking really, really nice. Okay, let's move on to the next figure. Okay, this one right here, it's actually a generic dinosaur from Takara Tomi NEA series. It is a Spinosaurus. So let's take a look. This is actually a Spinosaurus, which is quadrupedal, which means it can actually walk on four legs. Okay, so let's take a look at this. Beautiful. Okay. Let's move on to the next figure, which is a Pteranodon. Pteranodon is actually a prehistoric flying reptile. Okay, let's take a look. Awesome stuff. Okay, let's move on to the next figure, which is a Nasudoceratops. Okay, let's take a look. Open this up. Pseudoceratops is actually a Ceratopsian. Which Ceratopsian is your most favorite? Please let us know down below. Okay, this is the latest one which is similar to the Jurassic World Mattel action figure. Looks really good. You can actually rotate the head, but not arm the legs. You can move the tail as well. Okay, let's move on to the next figure which is the Indoraptor. Let's take a look at the box first. Beautiful box. You can see plenty of our illustrations. So let's open this up. This is the Indoraptor. Beautiful, but it doesn't have some feathers behind the head. So really nice figure right over here, which you can rotate the tail, you can move the legs as well. Let's move on to the next figure, which is the Elasmosaurus, or rather the Futabasaurus. So let's open this up and have a look. This is a prehistoric marine creature. So all these dinosaur figures, they are from Takara Tomi, which is a brand from Japan. I love this brand because um, I grew up playing with um, toys from this brand, and I really, really love them. It brings me some really good memories okay the next one is actually a styracosaurus this was actually released early this year as well so let's take a look at this and another ceratopsian beautiful ceratopsian let's take a look okay it's a gray styracosaurus beautiful styracosaurus is known as the spiked blizzard Let's take a look, Parasaurolophus. Let's take a look at this. Oops, it is back into the box. So Parasaurolophus is known as the near crested lizard. This is also a brand new figure from Takara Tomi. You can actually move the tail, the neck, and the head. Okay, nice. Let's move on to the Sticky Moloch. Sticky Moloch is actually known as the River Stick Demon. So this is a beautiful figure, you can move the tail, you can move the legs, and yeah, no, 
but not the head. Beautifully painted. I love this figure. I think this is one of the best from Takara Tomi. Let's move on to the next one, which is a Stegosaurus. Check this out. Beautiful. Roof Lizard. The next figure is another figure from Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. So let's take a look. Carnotaurus is actually known as the meat eating bone. Okay, this is a nice figure. Let's move on. Indominus Rex. This is a brand new one which I really, really, really like. Okay, let's take a look. Indominus Rex. Untamable Teeth. Or, or Untamable King. Untamable Teeth is actually um, Indoraptor. This is brilliant. I love this. This is a very, very nice figure. We are left with a couple of more. This is a T-Rex. Looks really nice. This is a Mosasaurus. Mosasaurus from Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. Another awesome figure. Okay, so let's move on. Brachiosaurus. This is actually an um, old figure. Oops, where is the head? She's right here. Stepping right back. Brachiosaurus. The arm lizard. A couple of more. We have blue right here. Blue is, actu is actually missing a tail. A part of the tail. Okay, so this is blue. You can move the tail and the jaw. And we have a T Rex. This is a uh, feathered T Rex. Nice one. Okay, we have a generic Conotaurus. Okay, check this out. The meat eating bull. The Jurassic World version is definitely a nicer one. And our last box from, um, from Jurassic World is actually Baby Blue and um, a Pteranodon. So let's take a look. Actually, a pretty small pteranodon. I can move the wings. Very nicely done. I love it. And we have a baby blue, which is so cute. And of course, you can actually um, use this with part of um, you know Mattel's figures, like you know Owen figures. They're gonna look really good. And Kylosaurus. It will be nice if. If they can actually produce an Ankylosaurus for, for Jurassic World, that would be really nice. So this is beautiful, it has armor and a club at the end of the tail. Next up, we have a saber-toothed tiger and a Homo nindatalensis, which is a prehistoric man. And this is the saber-toothed cat, which looks really nice as well. So this is from the original NEA series. So let me just place this back into the box. And our last figure of the day is actually a um, green velociraptor, which is also a um, an original NEA figure. Okay, so let's take a look. Pretty good stuff from uh, Takara Tomi, I would say. So. I'm gonna choose my most favorite figure. Definitely the Indominus Rex. And of course, um, I love the Indoraptor. So, this is definitely one of my top three. And 
last but not least, I'm gonna choose the Mosasaurus. So these three are my most favorite. What about you? Let me know down below and I hope that you guys enjoy this video, okay? Uh, make sure you subscribe and um, yeah, if you like dinosaurs and Jurassic World and check out my channel on a daily basis because I upload dinosaur videos every single day. So make sure you subscribe, okay? And check out my channel on a daily basis. Soon, you will no longer be getting notifications from um, toys channels on YouTube. Yeah, that's a very sad thing. So make sure you subscribe and check out my channel every single day at the same time. I upload dinosaur videos every single day, okay? So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye.